Hey guys, what's up? Android N has been out for pretty long and a lot of you wanted it for the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 and so finally it is available for it. So let's get started. So before starting, you need to have a custom recovery installed. For that, visit our website. The link is in the description box below. Also download the ROM and the latest Google Apps and save them into your SD card. Start by pressing the volume up, home and power button all together. Keep holding them until you see the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 logo. And then leave them to boot into recovery. Make sure you have the latest TWRP recovery installed. It should be greater than 3.0x. Once you're in the recovery, make sure to make a backup. Go back. Go to wipe. Swipe to factory reset. Now go back to the main menu again. Go to install. Select your storage. Mine is in the SD card. Now go to the folder where the ROM was saved at. Select the ROM and swipe to flash. Ignore the errors, if any. Once done, similarly flash the latest Google Apps in similar fashion. Now reboot. Wait for the phone to boot up. It may take a few minutes, so be patient. The phone has finally booted up. Let's check the Android version. It is running on the latest Android Nugget 7.0. You get the new notification bar with the quick settings. And these settings can be edited as well. In settings, you get the suggestions on top. Speaking of customization, you can change your status bar settings ranging from battery percentage to quick pull down. You also get button settings. You can change the layouts and the light settings of the buttons. So pretty decent. Coming to what's working and what's not. Mobile data, Wi-Fi, network, calling, everything works. The camera is also working, with the image capture working just fine. But the video shooting has some bugs right now. It didn't work the first time, but now it is working. The only major bug with this ROM is video playback. Most videos do not work, even the ones that are inside the apps, so this can be frustrating for some. Other than this, everything works just fine. So I think it can be used as a daily driver. So guys, this is it from the video. Do try out this ROM and thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.